Hello and welcome to the excellent English Club. Today's topic is production of vowel sounds. So let's start. Look here. As I told you, there are 20 vowel sounds, 12 pure vowel or mono of thongs, which we have already discussed. Now the second part that is eight diphthongs. What are these thongs? Look here. Diphthong or the vowel glide is the combination of two sounds which make one syllable. As I told you in my previous lectures, what is a syllable? A word or a part of word which is spoken in one, one stroke of chest pulse, that is for example two, so one syllable today, two syllable tomorrow, three syllables, this is syllable, okay? So combination of two vowels make one vowel and produce one syllable though each vowel sound or monophthong makes a syllable but when two vowels are combined to make a diphthong that also make one syllable if you are using two vowels together as a diphthong that is also considers one vowel and it is also known as diphthong or one syllable now look here I have put the tongue diagram, okay? This is very small, you cannot see clearly. Let me show you the bigger one. This is the big one and you can see that all the diphthongs are here. Means from our tongue glides from one vowel to another vowel. For example, if you talk about this one, it is pronounced as A. A. So our tongue glides from A to E. A. E tongue glides from one vowel to another vowel and these arrows showing that from which vowel the tongue is glides to another vowel these are the arrows i will tell you one by one in another diagram look here this diagram showing the complete 12 pure vowels and now i will show you the diphthongs one by one for example look here for example a and e we will produce this sound from a to e it is called a how look here a like pay bay today like this day this type of sound will produce with the help of this depth thong a second number two look here i a and e that is I, I, like I, I will say the word I, I am going, I, that is also I, my, okay, these are the words will be produced with the help of this diphthong, I. The next one is OI, like in boy, toy, like this, that is OI, O and I, OI, for example, boy, toy. Canvoy like this. The next one is look here. Ow. What is this? Ow. The glides from a schwa to u. Ow. This is ow. Like no. Go. Like this. The next one is ow. What is this? Ow. Like how. We'll say how. We will use this diphthong. How. Next is Ia. The first one was a. This one, this one is ia. Like here, here, there, like this. Next one is a. This one, a a, a a, a plus sho. Yeah, as in here. This is the last one. Ua. Ia a ua. Ua. This is ua. Ua ua. Like poor, tour. These are the vowel glides. Now let me show you the production of vowel glides or diphthongs. Look here. This is the chart which will tell you about all the diphthongs, how they produce, what, what is the position of the tongue or what is the position of our lips and what is our opening of the jaws. So look here because there are two different vowels together, okay, like A, I, I, O, O, I, 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 O, I,
So one by one, you will see that, for example, A, the first vowel, initial vowel and final vowel. Initial means the first one, final means the last one. So there are two different vowels make one diphthong. So first one, opening of the jaws between half close and half open. Position of the tongue, front side. Position of the leaf, unrounded. And the second vowel, E, opening of the jaws, half close. Position of the tongue, front. Position of the lips, unrounded. Similarly, I, A, when it, we produce A, it is open. Then it is at the back part of our tongue and it is unrounded. A, we are not making rounded. The second one is I again, same thing, half close, front and rounded. The third one is again, O, between half close and half open, back part of the tongue and while producing our lips are rounded. O. And the second one is same, E, 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 everywhere. So it is half close, front and unrounded. Move to the number four, O, A, half close. We use our central part of our tongue. Then while producing this A, the lips are unrounded. O, half close, back of the tongue and rounded. O, right? Similarly, A, O. Again, when say A, ah, like the second one here, A, ah, I, this is A, ah, U. When we produce A, ah, U, that is open, back, unrounded. And U, as I told you here, half close, back, rounded. Similarly, U here, half close, back, rounded. Next is E, A, E, A. The ear is half close, front unrounded. The second is schwa, that is half close, central unrounded. Schwa is at the center of our tongue. Then ear, again, between half close and half open, front unrounded, and same thing is here, schwa, half close, central unrounded. The third one is ua, half close, back, rounded. U, and A, as I told you, that is schwa, same thing, half close, central, unrounded. This is the three term description of all vowel glides. As I told you, there are 20 vowel sounds, 12 pure vowels or monophthongs, and 8 diphthongs or vowel glides. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. See you in the next video. Bye bye.